Hey guys, for the just let you know that Samsung have on a new event showed off what I believe is going to be the Samsung Galaxy S3 processor. It is the new Exynos processor, the first quad core that they have showed off that is being clocked at 1.8 gigahertz. It is the 40, 4412 uh, one that is running on the new GPU Mali, Mali 604 compared to the Mali 400 as we get in the Samsung Galaxy S2 and the Samsung Galaxy Note. And uh, as I said there, the Exynos version is 4412. Uh, that's their system on a chip, latest version. And we also heard this uh, about this new 50 or 5000 uh, Exynos processor, but probably not going to see that one right now, but next year. But uh, the 4210, that's the one that is being in the Samsung Galaxy S2 and the Samsung Galaxy Note. And the interesting thing here is that this with this new one, uh, the one in the S2 and the Galaxy Note is a 45 nanometer process uh, that they use to build it. This one's only going to be 32 millimeters, and the performance is going to be between 35 to 50 percent better, you know, in gaming and stuff like that. And also the power consump consumption is also going to be like 50% better, you know, 50% like less. Here you can see on these tests we have uh, the 4210 versus the 4212. You can see the, uh, that it did decrease it to minus 46% here in the GPU 3D uh, power consumption. And also we have a CPU test here, minus uh, 36%. So it's, uh, it's, it's going to be very, very interesting to see when they're going to show this uh, processor off. And it's going to be interesting to see how it's going to be uh, versus Tegra 3. I think it's uh, being it's being clocked up with 3 gigahertz, like on the Transformer Prime, I think. And uh, then I see some new devices, like right now it's going to be coming out on MVC, you know, quad core devices from like LG and ACC, that they're going to be clocked like around 1.5 gigahertz. And if this one, eight, uh, one put the, this uh, from Samsung is going to be clocked at 1.8 gigahertz, quad core yeah that's interesting but you know of course it's not all about the clock it's you know about how the Exynos processor is working and stuff like that so it's going to be interesting to compare also the Mali 604 GPU versus uh, Nvidia Tegra 3 so um, that's uh, all we have right now I'm just waiting next uh, month we're probably going to get the new iPad 3 and also a dedicated Samsung event hopefully uh, where they will be unveiling the new Samsung ISS 3 with this Exynos 4412 processor that's gonna kick ass. Still Cortex A9, yeah, it's still Cortex A9, and we're probably gonna see Cortex A15 in the future, but that's probably not gonna happen before, you know, we're probably gonna see that maybe in the Galaxy S4. Yeah, see.